please welcome our mistress of ceremonies from Author Services, Executive Director for Fiction Affairs, Ms. Gunhild Jacobs. Thank you very much. It was in this very room in 1929 that the first Academy Award ceremony took place with the legendary actor Douglas Fairbanks and singer Al Jolson presenting each of the evening's 13 Oscars. Tonight is another type of historic event, a truly momentous occasion celebrating 25 years of discovering new talent in all aspects of speculative fiction. For it was... For it was in the first volume of the Writers of the Future that L. Ron Hubbard stated, the artist injects the spirit of life into a culture, and through his creative endeavors, the writer works continually to give tomorrow a new form. In these modern times, there are many communication lines for works of art. Because a few works of art can be shown so easily to so many, there may even be fewer artists. The competition is very keen and even dagger sharp. And upon those words was launched what has since become the most successful merit competition of its kind in the world. So, on behalf of everyone at Author Services, the literary agency of L. Ron Hubbard, Galaxy Press, the publisher of the L. Ron Hubbard Presents Writers of the Future Anthology, and the esteemed judges of this contest, let me welcome each and every one of you this evening as we honor the winners of this year's Writers and Illustrators of the Future contests. We have received numerous letters of congratulations from those unable to attend, and I would like to take a few moments to share a few of these with you. Science fiction grandmaster Anne McCaffrey sent in these words. First, let me mention how very much I wish I were also there, but at 83, even air travel is difficult and taxing. I miss the adventure of meeting new writers and artists of our special genre, especially when they are recipients of the generosity of L. Ron Hubbard, whose early career made him so aware of the problems of writing in general and of science fiction in particular, that he set up the scheme of writers and artists of the future to assist dreamers to realize their potentials. Not only are you here to learn more about your future, you are able to recognize the most important aspect, becoming published. Lift your glasses and your hearts to the fact that this is the 25th anniversary of the contest. It is a constant satisfaction to me to have been a judge in this wonderful program. And from the associate publisher of Publishers Weekly, congratulations to the writers and illustrators of the future contest. May you always remain that powerful statement of faith as well as direction in science fiction. And from the Association of American Publishers. The Association of American Publishers would like to congratulate the Writers of the Future winners for their boundless creativity, perseverance, and contribution in raising the bar with new and exciting stories which will help shape current and future generations of engaged readers. Founding contest judge and science fiction grandmaster Robert Silverberg wrote, Writing is not an easy profession, and the path to a professional career is a daunting one. The Writers of the Future contest is unique in its dedication to developing great writing careers. My congratulations to you all and to the program for its splendid efforts over these many years. and physics professor Gregory Benford, Nebula Award winner and advisor to the Department of Energy, NASA, and the White House, and the only other judge to have been with us since the inception of the contest, sent in these words. I salute all those at the Writers of the Future 25th anniversary celebration, an astonishing event. I'm sorry I can't be there to see so many friends celebrate and move forward into a future with even more fresh new writers who can frame the future for us all. 